Welcome back to Is It True News, and thank you for tuning in. I am going to try and make everyone understand how important stopping Resolution 118 is. The House thinks you are stupid. And at this point, I may have to agree with them. Our Constitution says that Congress shall make no law abridging our right to freedom of speech. Abridging means limit, shrink, stop stifle, shorten, restrict to an area. They shall not, period. They cannot, the House cannot even discuss it. Any law that is currently restricting any form of speech if free speech zones, and I didn't check, but if free speech zones are still currently laws, they are unconstitutional, and they are illegal. And these come with fines. They need to be fined $10,000 each or spend time in prison. And this is what our Constitution calls for, unless we start standing together and demanding that these, the Congress, men and women who voted for these stupid resolutions, be punished, you are going to be silenced. And when your daughter comes home from school being raped by a Muslim for not dressing according to his religion, you are not going to be able to speak against it if they pass Resolution 118. And if some Jew decides they want to take your baby girl at three days, three years in a day, just such a weird, I mean, it, it's gross in itself, but you, you have to wonder, three years in a day old, it has, the baby has to be at least three years in a day old, and then you can have intercourse, they say. It's actually rape, it's not intercourse. Uh, so then you will not be able to speak against that either. Or bestiality. Or child sacrifice. And I know, notice that when I speak regarding the Jewish religion, their beliefs, um, I don't get a whole lot of views. Or they take away the views, I really don't know. But it's time to wake up. They wrote this resolution 118, I believe it was April 5th, and passed it the same day. Our Constitution says the law has to be for everybody. Americans have not paid attention to what's been going on when they make law. We should be absolutely outraged. And we need to start demanding these people be fined and in prison when they do it, like our Constitution calls for. I'll leave this in link. I will leave actually the definition of abridged, abridging, in the description for your convenience. I strongly suggest if you do want, not want to live on your knees with your ass in the air with somebody's dick in your butt, you better stop this resolution now. Get on the phone, start tweeting, say it in your own words, but it is unconstitutional. They can't even propose a law. I mean, spend some time reading the Constitution. It's an eye-opener. 